Not to mention it is 15 minutes long. So if my mind goes blank from trying to talk, then forgive me. So I am challenged by I am challenged by Jake. I set my one mascot because I always get my tailwind in first. He says that Aichirachi. That's that's nice, I guess. God, this video is gonna be so long. That battle was so long. The actual battle took like 20 minutes, and the recording it took like 15 minutes. No, 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 no. The battle itself was 15 minutes, and had I recorded it on a slow computer, it would literally would have took like hours to record on a slow computer from a slow emulator. And if you don't have a good computer for that emulator, it's gonna go kabloop, just like that, and it's gonna take a really long time. I thought he was weak against Giga Drain, so I decided to use Giga Drain. And why did that guy just IM me? No, I, I don't want to talk to you. <sighs> and he just mat punched it to death. That's nice, I guess. That Terrakion too. This guy just, this guy can stall. This Pokemon can stall like a boss. Times infinity. The battle took so long. He would repeatedly switch out. I would repeatedly switch out. He will continuously throw around spikes and talk so it can tell how it would slowly whittle away my health. Each Pokemon of his would would take that hit, whatever I had in store for him. So in the end, I only get like one or two Pokemon of his knocked out. I don't know, I may just give up and commentate the rest of this video all together, because it's just long as hell. Uh. Uh. Well, let's see if I can figure, find something else to talk about. Let's talk about... Pokemon. Okay, let's talk about Pokemon. Okay, um... So I want to get to Pokemon's competitive battling. The, the competitive aspect of Pokemon, and... That's the only thing I could think I could really be good at, because some first-person shooter games I'm good at, depending on the opponent I'm against. But I'm really not that great. I still love to play them, though. But I have an Xbox as well, and I used to have Xbox Live, but it wants silver. I used to play Halo Reach a lot. I kind of got bored of that. Now, I'm starting to get bored of battling Pokemon, but that might be because I suck at single battles, and I can rate everyone on double and triple battles. So... It's usually this kind of standard rule, like everyone will say 6v6, standard rule. The standard rule is like some kind of magical rule that's governed by all of the Wi-Fi lands that everyone has to go by. Because pretty much everything Smogon does is law when it comes to Pokemon. He's <sighs> like, you don't know the list, you better look it up. Like, I don't know the tiers, I don't know which Pokemon I'm in which tier unless it's common sense. Like Arceus is an Uber, obviously because Arceus is, is an Uber Pokemon, it's an Ubers here. But, it's just like everything Smogon does is long to pretty much the majority of the competitive community, so I have to design a completely new team, since this team was designed for the VGCs, I can't do that, this team was, I just said that, didn't I? But, um, I need to make a team for the standard metagame, the one that pretty much everyone is playing. I'd have to go around and RNG abuse a whole new team just for that purpose, and that kind of makes me rage, because that's not what I wanted to do, you know? Let's see... Yeah, I have to I have to adapt to this whole standard rule everything, because everything Smogon does is lol to most of the Pokemon players, and that kind of gets my nerves. Because I have to adapt to a whole new metagame, otherwise I was just going with the VDC. And it was good for the most part for triples and doubles because it, it's what it's designed for, but it is not designed for singles as you can see here. It is not good for single battles at all. Um, God, I really hate not having any commentary because this is I am not going to get on my shit on my respawn like this. But how do you expect me to commentate a 15 minute video that all it really consists of is Pokemon stalling each other until one eventually dies from whittling, whittling away Poison, but this video just goes to show how bad I suck at single battles. So that's one of my weaknesses. I'm going to try to work on that. 
get on Pokemon Online, start making teams based off the standard meta game, and once I get something I like, I'll start RNG abusing it for on the real cartridge. Yeah. Well, I guess I could talk about talk a little about how I actually record these videos. Okay, so I have all my Pokemon battles on the real cartridge on a legitimate retail cartridge that you get from the store, you know. And then there's this flash cart, and it has Pokemon Black loaded on it as well. So I just jump through walls, fucking get all the way to Nimbus City, and get the first recorder. Since emulators today also have Wi-Fi on them, my computer isn't that fast. I have to say upload the battle video from the retail cartridge, then download it onto the flashcard cartridge. Convert the save so it'll work in the emulator to Semium. And it's a mod of the emulator that can record the top screen of the DS only, which is great for the Pokemon battles, because that's all people want to see. And plus, it's really good quality, depending on the codec. You select a slip Microsoft Video 1, and everything's at 100%, so the file size is ridiculous. The raw, the raw AVI for this battle was about 1.60 gigabytes, and would not fit on my flash drive, so I had to split it up into parts, which is bad. I'm recording it using the same emulator on this computer, which is the netbook, which I used to render the majority of my videos. Oh my god, that one took a long time. But, well, I can't think of much else from any other games that can upload that won't lag severely when I try to play. Because nobody likes lag, and it's just... This makes things unvirtually playable for you, and why is this guy IMing me again? I'm kind of wondering how he did not. Uh, why that jump? Ugh. That Tentacruel did not. wasn't super effective. It must be poison type only or something. Because I'm pretty sure it was water type the last time I checked. But that ability, Liquid Ooze, just kind of sucked it up. Like a vacuum. <laughs> Suck it up like a vacuum. I'm just basically stalling, trying to inflict poison on all of my Pokemon. And since it's standard rules, you can only have one Pokemon sleep at a time, and if I put more than one of his Pokemon sleep on the, on the, at a time, purposely, he would probably go bitch about it. Um... Yeah. So that's one of the boring parts of the game. You cannot spam Spore. Especially in a single battle, if you put Spore on, it will not matter anymore, because... Let's switch out the Pokemon that's asleep. Because you purposely can't can't put any more Pokemon asleep. And if you destroy that one, then you'll have another chance to put one asleep without violating the, the magical rules of the magical law that Smogon puts out all the time. As for other games that I want to play, I want to do a few Halo Reach commentaries, but the gameplay will not always be that great because I'm simply not that great at it. I also want to do Final Fantasy, Final Fantasy 13 on the 360 just because I want to play that game really, really bad. And I could do a Let's Play if I was r really desperate. I don't know if Machinima Respawn would let us set that kind of stuff, but it would be that'd be pretty cool. Look, so still get a variety of videos uploaded. But the catch card I have right now, the quality is crap, and I doubt that will be accepted anytime soon. So I have to get a decent capture card. The only thing I can really do is upload high quality Pokemon battles and PC games whenever I get the chance to record with fraps. Let's see. Yeah, that's just how I record my video. My my videos. My videos. And my god, I'm so sorry for not having anything to talk about. Seriously, this is a long ass battle. Oh, background music, that's right. I usually try to find background music for each video because the game audio gets a little bit repetitive after a while and I'm trying to find something that isn't licensed or isn't remotely even remotely copyrighted or made by somebody else. So I was trying to make my own remixes just for that purpose and it doesn't work because I can't make good quality stuff. <laughs> I seriously can't make good stuff in FL Studio. So sometimes I have to limit them to myself to what I use. The only kind of remixes I've used so far is 
Pokemon remixes by Poke Remix Diodo, and if you haven't seen him before, then you must be high because he's got a decent amount of views on his remixes. Considerably the Abandoned Ship and the Distortion World remix. Those are those are pretty good. Wish I could make awesome remixes like his, but I have to either restate to the to the game audio or get something else. If I made like Halo Reach commentaries, I wouldn't be using external game audio. That would just be annoying. You'd be like seeing a whole lot of Black Ops with, with extreme heavy metal in the background, and I just get bored of hearing that every time. Getting views is what I'm having the most problem with, and getting noticed in the YouTube community, that's a problem. That's hard for me. During my four years, four or five years here on YouTube, I've been here since December 30th, 2006. And yes, I checked. And... Let's... Yeah, my mind's going blank. Um, I have not been able to get hardly any views. The, h the highest number of views I ever had on a video at one time was about that 1,500. I, I don't even know how that happened. I must have some good tags or something. Some really good tag choices, because I always pick the wrong tags. So what I'm starting to do is go on other people's videos that also do the same thing that I do, Pokemon Battles, copy their tags, put their tags into my videos, and I can see some of my videos actually appear on the related videos for once, instead of them just hawking up a whole bunch of space. <coughs> Blame truth. Uh, yeah. Wow, this video is almost over. Yeah, this guy was seriously difficult. I am just tired of getting my ass kicked at the standard single battle metagame. I got, I've got to make a good team that can stall and piss people off. But it will never be a main team, but it'll be good because a lot of people do standard battles now. So you usually try to go to places like Zerbi or Smogon to find some Wi-Fi battles because people on random matchup always quit. And for the people that don't know, yes, there's a mode on Pokemon Black and White. It's kind of like matchmaking in Halo Reach and Black Ops. You can find other players to set that they won't get banned if they quit. They can quit anytime they want to simply by switching off their DS. It's, it's really annoying. I've had a lot of people rage quit on me. So my win loss record isn't even that high. Because it's just not that high. I've hardly got any losses and I've already got any wins. I could have like 12 wins on Triple Battles ratings matchup. So where we can search by rating. I could have like 11, 1, 11 and 4, 11 wins and 4 losses, but there's only like 1 loss and 4 wins because people keep on rage quitting. This moment their last Pokemon loses their last bit of HP, they rage quit or whenever I spoil everything to death. Basically, I can go a random matchup, triple and double battles and rate people, but I've only tried single battles like once and I did not like it. I don't like single battles, I really don't. It's just really my weakness and I really got to work on that. Well, I don't know if I'll even be able to find any bound on music to fit this battle, but, oh god. Excuse me for a second. <coughs> I just, I just cannot think of anything to put for extremely long battles. I cannot think of any background music or anything to talk about unless it's something I really like. Let's see. Oh, I got a one. Ocarina of Time. That, that was a good game. And no matter how many times you say the word rehash to me, I will still like it. I will definitely get bored of it sometimes, but yeah, they made a remake of it in the 3DS. It came out a few, not too long ago. Wish I could have that, but I don't even have money to get the 3DS. Much less for the my Xbox Live membership or get a new battery pack for my controller because I left it at my friend's house and. Uh, what else? What else do I need to complain about? Um, no, nope, that wouldn't be about it. Okay, let's talk about what I want to do with these videos on the channel. Okay, I want to make good commentary videos and stuff like that. Let's play the, the usual. Get them uploaded to Machinima Respawn. And the reason why I'm saying Machinima Respawn is because I'm the normal Machinima before they had Machinima Respawn. During Black Ops, Halo Reach, and Halo 3, gameplay commentary is all over the place, and I was just sick of seeing it in my subscriptions box, and now I can see less of that because I made the channel mission respawn a lot of Halo commentaries and play there. Which commentary is interesting that I'm not going to be interesting as like it, because it's a lot of stuff. Um, let's see.
Yeah, I'm not gonna think there. Um.